Is your system unsupported to upgrade to Windows 11? No worries. In this video, I will show you how can you clean install Windows 11 from ISO and run it on your unsupported hardware. You do not need to have TPM 2.0 secure boot or 8GB of RAM. I would suggest backup your data before beginning this process. If you have multiple partitions on your hard disk or SSD, then backing up just the C drive will suffice as we are not going to touch any other existing partition. That being said, let's get started and hit the like button if this video helps you. First of all, let's head over to the official Windows 11 downloads page and download Windows 11 disk image ISO. Click Windows 11, choose the language and click on 64-bit. Click confirm to start the download now. We also need one more small ISO burning app called Rufus. Links for all these sites will be given in the description for reference. Click on the big download button and open the app after it finishes downloading. Choose carefully your flash drive first and then browse for the downloaded Windows 11 file. Now under the image option, select extended Windows 11 installation. This will remove the soft limits of Windows 11 installer. Once done, click start. If you have an MBR file structured hard drive, then change the value from GPT to MBR. If you are unsure, leave it at GPT partition scheme. Click start and wait till it finishes writing to the flash drive. Once finished, we will move to the next step for installation. Restart your PC and press F12 key while it boots. You would see list of bootable devices being displayed from there. We need to select our UEFI flash drive name. In my case it is the HP V236W. Select that and hit enter. On this page, choose what suits your region and proceed further. Hit next and on the page, choose I do not have a product key even if you have it as it will load the product key for you when you connect your PC to the internet for the first time. On the next screen, choose the edition of Windows you want. I will choose Windows 11 Pro for this video. And now comes the most important step, so do it very carefully. To avoid any unwanted data loss, we will choose custom install as we are performing a clean install for this video. If you have multiple drives on your PC, your drive will look like drive 0, drive 1 etc. If you have a single disk, you will only have the letter drive 0. Now carefully select the correct partition and drive letter, for example drive 0 partition 1. To be sure that the partition is your C drive or correct disk, check the size on the right side. Once you become sure, click on the right drive and click format. For example, I will be using the entire disk of the drive 2 for installation which is a 1TB drive and I will select that and format to move next. All your work is done now, wait till it finishes installing and boots to the welcome page. 
just follow the on screen instructions and put your name and password and all that stuff to get to the home screen of your newly installed windows 11. enjoy windows 11 on your unsupported hardware if you face any problem in these steps please feel free and let me know your query i will definitely help you out this is a week signing off catch you in the next one